the transfer for approximately 17 and a half years. I'm a man of God. I love God. Uh, I was raised by, you know, wonderful people, my grandparents, my grandmother, my great-grandmother. Uh, once I graduated high school, I made a determination to go into the United States Air Force. I stayed approximately uh, 17 years in the Air Force. After leaving the Air Force, I got out and I worked for Federal Express. I worked for Federal Express for about 18 years. And I've come here, and this is my third and last career, which is New Jersey Transit. Well, my job in the Air Force, I traveled mostly around the world um, doing logistical and strategic things as far as logistics. Um, I was a PME training instructor. Um, I've, I've done quite a few different things. I was first a, a police officer and, uh, you know, just was able to really enjoy myself in the time being in the military. I did serve in Iraq. I was uh, working for General Schwarzkopf Joint Communications. We were the, four, we were the first unit to uh, actually set up communications in Iraq when Desert Shield, Desert Storm kicked off back in 1991. So I'm very proud of that accomplishment and uh, I'm very happy to have been able to serve during that time in the military. My message to other veterans today would be to stand proud, to be uh, responsible, to know that we are examples for every other young child or young man or young woman that's going in the military today. Um, performance is by how we dress, by how we act, and how we treat other people. The very things that I learned in the military have transferred over into my experience with New Jersey Transit. Uh, I am a people person. I work with people. When people are injured, when people need something, it is my responsibility to make sure that I'm there. So being a transitional person from the military to this environment is very easy. It's not a problem because we uh, always adapt to any situation that can happen at any time.